so welcome back again and today is market opened and i'm going to introduce you my uh, new uh, fibonacci tools and before i uh, going to share that tool uh, i'm going to explain um about the order block a little bit okay so okay so last week uh, last week we see that our price really um we, we just really missed the our price right and uh, yeah and it's okay because uh, it's happened uh, but the question uh, is why we uh, miss that like why we miss that zone right why we miss that zone and what could be the reason to uh, never miss that uh, entry again so for that and for that i'm going to um, do some analysis and find out the fibonacci way okay so let me show you there's the new tool okay a smart people jones okay that's the new uh, fibonacci a smart new uh, people jones uh, you guys just uh, use it as default okay and before i uh, add it onto chart let me show you the settings first like look back that's a candle period of course calculation mode is the week or pin bar or close make it close and structure length is the finding swing high and low points number of zones how many uh people not see zones you want to uh display on your chart okay and zone display here you can see the both bearish only bullish only okay and zone extend false just guys uh make it default okay you guys don't have to do anything and if you guys have a uh, good knowledge uh, about the fibonacci then you guys can edit this level because this is totally dynamic setting uh, if you guys uh, change the settings like 0 0.3 uh, 3 equal or uh, you guys can try to type uh, 0, uh, 0 0.6 whatever you guys type it's automatic adjust on your chart okay just use it default guys okay i just uh, make it that way okay and now click okay all right now we can see now now we can compare and one more settings before um, i show more things uh one more settings let me go to the settings uh you guys can see that's the uh, background color okay that's the fibonacci high and low color okay that's the fibonacci high and low background color okay so if you guys want to uh decrease the background color just make it zero two okay just take a look keep watching that background color that's the opacity background color opacity okay and if i click okay you can you guys can see that color is now more likely to see okay all right so now uh, after i set this you guys can easily see that fibonacci easily cast that entry right and in here we can see that price really dropped that area and it's uh running or hit the tp1 the way and i'm pretty sure that price going to uh or forward to the tp2 for sure okay so what could be happen that price might be uh drop a little bit and then it's go like this okay that could be the happened so now uh if i uh switch to the my water block you you guys can see that's our like that's that's the point that our order block okay uh, missed that entry it, it's actually not not missed that uh, entry 
but if we combine both like Fibonacci and the order blocks okay then I think uh, we don't have to chase the market okay we don't have to chase the market you guys can clearly see so yeah guys that's pretty much simple uh, is it uh, there is the two way you guys can uh, enter the market like that's the uh, entry one and that's the entry two and that's the Fibonacci uh, high swing high and that's the swing low okay so and inside that zone like that zone uh, yeah so that zone you you guys also consider uh, as order block okay it's Fibonacci order block you guys uh, con consider it okay and let me show you that how this draw okay I'm uh, that's the Fibonacci I just uh, point the high and low and take a look and now that that's the level you guys can see that's the level one that's the level zero okay and the entry two it's actually uh, the swing high and the uh, stop loss I, I mark here is the swing low see and entry one is uh, 0 0.7 and the mid level is 0 0.5 and 0 0.3 so you guys are consider this three zone 0 0.75 and 3 as order block okay but you guys also consider uh, to entry the level one as well okay it's kind of depends on analyze okay and and also now you guys can see the tp1 is 161 okay and if i mark this you guys can see that's the tp2 and that's the tp3 okay so as I uh, told you guys that market could be like this way okay but who knows uh, uh, yeah guys so when market is bullish then uh, the uh, Fibonacci's color is become green okay and when market is bearish it becomes red let me show you okay now in here uh, let me remove this let me uh, go to the one more pair all right that's the perfect one now in uh, now in here we can see clearly that's the swing high uh, that's the swing high okay and that's the swing low so if we uh, uh, draw the Fibonacci we can see this setting now in here we can see that's the our entry point okay and that's our order block Fibonacci order block we can say but if you guys see clearly that price drop from here okay price drop uh, drop from that level as well so the entry two is also important else uh, entry one entry two both are important area to enter the market and if it's not hit the tp2 then the price highly chance that pull back and break that tp2 level and again it should be like this okay so yeah that, that's the really advanced fibonacci way you guys can use but i just make it very easy to use for everyone okay and just just combine with the order block okay just combine uh with the order block but don't try to find out the both the both entry in the same way like let me uh, show you let me add that indicator in here a smart fever jones okay now you guys can see i uh, can't i can't see the fibonacci labels or the jones that is why i just add this h button okay so if you guys click on this okay like if i click on the edge then the chart is disappear 
and if I click again uh, the Fibonacci levels are going to display see so now you guys can see uh, that's uh, that's our entry to that's that's our order block volume order block and that's the Fibonacci entries and it's it's just uh, showing the same way right it's showing uh, both order block are just masked but it's not going to happen all the time okay so you have to do some analyze like Fibonacci and the volume order blocks and the of course you guys can use the smart liquidity profile which uh, helps you to more to get the entry okay so uh, so in euro GBP so again let me show you if you guys click H that levels are uh, dis uh, disappear or not display on the chart okay uh, like this see but I think that's a good entry and you guys can see the Fibonacci uh, level become red okay and let me show you one more pair uh, okay so that's the another good entry okay and let me a uh, smart people Jones now number of Jones I just make it two click okay so you guys can see that uh, uh, Fibonacci's are become two now and it's overlapping uh, each other okay but I, I prefer to use that one and if you guys select one then it's always going to show you the recent zone only okay not the old zone okay like if i click one it's just showing the recent so you guys can easily uh, identify the market okay now uh, with the volume order block like usd cat and yeah that's pretty good enough so hope you guys understand how the uh, Fibonacci uh, going to work okay and yeah let's see anymore Okay, so that all the USD, you guys can see all the USD, and that's the uh, swing high, that's the swing low, and we can uh, we can see that's uh, I think that that's the news time, and I prefer to use that order block for the time tree, okay, and the stop loss like in here and it's not break the tp1 so i i, I will um, make my target tp1 okay so yeah so you guys have to practice on the, uh, that and and one more thing guys that not my tools are magical or going to uh <laughs> make you risk okay my tools are just going to help you to understand or read the chart only so you can decide uh, better okay and yeah guys so thanks for watching and uh, yeah and this tool available on mt4 and mt5 go get it now and let me know if you guys uh, see a, any kinds of issues so until then uh, wish you uh, all the best and happy trading and always remember believe in yourself okay and of course if you are focused on trading don't forget to manage your risk okay that's the that's the success of your trading journey okay okay guys thank you